of students' problem nowadays is how to solve and understand well their lessons. So what if you encounter the solving problem related to statistics? Let us first know the definition of mean, median, and mode. Mean. This is the value obtained by adding the values in the distribution and dividing the sum by the total of numbers. Median. This is a positional measure defined as the middlemost values in the distribution. And mode is the value which appears often and has the greatest frequency. How to find the mean? We can find the mean by using the midpoints. There is also called the midpoint formula. We can simply take the average of each class. For example, 51 and 55. The average is 53. Here is the table showing the frequencies in the midpoint. Next, we have to multiply each midpoint by each frequency. Add them up and divide it by the total frequency, which is 21. The summation of f times x divided by n is equals to 61.33. And this will now be the value of mean. Low. Your score. How to find the median for group data? The median is the middle value, which in our case is the 11th term or the class interval of 61 to 65. We call it 61 to 65, but it includes the values from 60.5 to 65. Why? Well, the values are measured in two seconds, so the real time of 60.5 is measured as 61. Likewise, 64.5 is measured as 65. So let's have the formula for finding the median. Median is equals to LB plus the quantity of N over 2 minus CF over F times I, wherein LB is the lower class boundary of the group containing the median, N is the total number of values, CF is the cumulative frequency of the groups before the median group, F is the frequency of the median group, and I is the group width or interval. Ah, sige, salamat. Hey, Paris. Tapos ka na ba sa assignment? Papaturo sa na sana ako paano natin yung mode. So, how to find the mode? We can say that the modal group is 61 to 65 because it has the highest frequency. We can find the mode by having the formula. Mode is equal to LB plus the quantity of delta 1 over delta 1 plus delta 2 multiplied by the interval where LB is the lower boundary of modal class, delta 1 is the difference of the frequencies of the modal class and the interval preceding it, delta 2 is the difference of the frequencies of the modal class and interval after it, and I is the class interval. having this tutorial video and that is to teach you about the measures of central tendency, the mean, median, and mode for group data. Thank you guys and God bless. Sir, what can I do? Sorry Vince, I already told you I won't accept late papers. Pero, joke lang. Sige na, okay. Congrats on passing.